so much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout, Flippy! Whoa! Aloha! It's me, Flippy, and look where I'm at! Today, I'm on Oahu, which is an island of Hawaii. Wow, isn't it beautiful here? Yeah, the trees are so green, there's so much green grass, and the shrubs and trees look so happy! Whoa! Hey, wouldn't it be really cool to see what this beautiful place looks like really high in the sky? Yeah! Why don't today we ride a helicopter and see what it looks like? And actually, Magnum Helicopters here on Oahu is coming here to give me a ride! Yeah, I'm so excited! Do you hear it? Oh yeah! Oh, there it is right there! Whoa, <laughs> Whoa it's so high! Whoa! Hey up there! Whoa! Wow, I am so excited. I bet everything is gonna look really small from up there. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> oh, it's landing! Oh! All right. Wow, I'm so excited. All right, now that the rotors are stopped, why don't we go say hi? <laughs> Whoa, that was really cool! Hey, who are you? Hi, my name's Doug. I'm the chief pilot at Magnum Helicopters. Oh, nice to meet you. I'm Blippi. Wow, this is a very cool helicopter. Whoa, how long have you been flying helicopters for? I've been flying for 20 years. Wow, 20 years? That's a very long time. Do you know how many hours you have flying helicopters? I have over 5,000 hours. Whoa! Now that is a lot of hours. Whoa, do you mind if I take a closer look at your helicopter? Not at all. Wow, come on! Whoa, what a colorful helicopter. It's the color orange, ooh, and yellow, ooh, and brown. Whoa! Hey, Doug, what's this thing for? That's just a step so the passengers can climb up into the helicopter. Oh, cool! Oh, yeah, and it looks like there's some seats back here. Ooh, and some seats up here. Whoa, how many people can fly in this helicopter? Oh, uh, the pilot can bring four people with him if he wants. Wow, cool, and what kind of helicopter is this? This is an MD-500. Wow, MD-500. Whoa, and up there, I know what those are. And those are the rotors, right? That's right. Wow, and what does this rotor do? So the rotor, it spins around like a big fan and it blows the air down, creates lift, then lifts the helicopter up off the ground. Whoa, cool. So this main rotor creates lift, so then the helicopter can fly. And there's another rotor back here that I know. Can we check it out? Yes, sir. Wow, yeah. And this rotor is called the tail rotor. Whoa, cool. And what does this do, Doug? This can spin the helicopter left and right so it can face any direction that we want it to. All right, so the main rotor creates the lift, and then this rotor, yeah, makes the helicopter turn. Really cool. Oh, and I know what that is. That's the boom, right? Mm-hmm. Wow. And is this the number and letters of this exact helicopter? Yes, sir. They call it the tail number. Tail number. And I have a fun thing for us to do. Do you mind saying this with me at the same time? All right. All right, let's do it. N, N three, five, seven, M, H. Wow, awesome. Whoa, what's this, Doug? Oh, this is the engine back here. You want to see? Right. Yeah, I'd love to. All right, this is going to be so cool seeing the engine of a helicopter. Whoa, come check it out. Whoa, I'm going to be very careful because it might still be hot. Oh, it looks very complicated. Whoa, and back here, look how dirty it looks. This must be the exhaust. Whoa, thank you so much for letting us check out the engine of that helicopter. Whoa, can You're we welcome. check out the front? Yes, sir. All right. Come on hey. this way. Wait a second, I know what these are. These are landing skids, right? Mm -hmm. Wow, why are they so unique looking compared to an airplane? They have wheels and tires, right? Right, an airplane has wheels because it has to land moving forward on a runway and has to slow down. But a helicopter can slow down before it lands on the ground and actually go straight down. Wow, cool. So helicopters can go many, many places because they can land and take off completely vertical like that. Oh, cool. Whoa, and this is where you sit? Yes, it is. On this side? Mm hmm that's the pilot seat right there. Oh, cool. Ooh, and what's this called? This is called the collective. Oh, collective. I remember that. That's what controls the vertical lift, right? Right, makes the helicopter go up and down. Oh, cool. And this is the cyclic? Yes. And what do you use that for? That can steer the helicopter. Oh, cool. And look at all those gauges. What are all those gauges for? Oh, well, we have gauges to keep an eye on uh, the engine, also how high we fly and how fast we're flying. Wow, they look very complicated. <laughs> you must be very smart. <laughs> wow, and there's different types of helicopters, right? Mm hmm Like firefighting helicopters, like... Rescue helicopters. Or police helicopters. And what do you say this is? This is an air tour helicopter. Ooh, an air tour. Well, perfect. I was actually thinking I could go for a ride around here. Oh, and this would be a great helicopter for it. Because do you see the doors? No, you don't, because there's no doors. <laughs> do you mind if we go for a spin? That'd be great. All right, where should I sit? I'll come around here, hop in the front seat with me. All right, <laughs> cool. 
Whoa. So just climb on in? Sure, climb on up. All right. <laughs> cool. Whoa, it's so high up here. Wow, so cozy. How do I get, get started? Well, let's put your seatbelt on. Make sure it's nice and tight. Okay, just like in a car. Gotta buckle up. All right, all right, now what? Now take that orange headset right there, put that on so we can talk to each other. Oh, cool. Yeah, orange is one of my two favorite colors. <laughs> all right. Hello, hello. So are you gonna wear one too? Yes, I will. All right, let's do this. I'm so excited. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa, here we go. Wow, it feels so cool to be flying. Whoa, look at those trees to the left. Wow, oh, they're so green. Whoa, check this out. That is a big mountain. Do you see how steep it is? Wow, it goes straight up and down. Whoa, let's head to the ocean. Whoa, check it out. That looks like a small town next to the ocean. Wow, wouldn't it be nice to live there? <laughs> Whoa, and look over there. There's that big mountain we saw from the ground. Wow, it is so cool how there's trees at the very tippy top of it. Wow, now that is some blue water. Wow, Doug, you are such a great pilot. You brought me all the way out to the ocean. Wow, isn't the ocean so vast? I bet there's a lot of sea creatures that live out here. Wow, look at the top of the mountain. Do you see that town down there? Wow, I bet they have some pretty views. Not like views like these though. It's like we're a bird. Kaka! <laughs> this is so beautiful. Now that is a deep valley. Whoa, and the beaches stretch for so long. Whoa, <laughs> you can't even see rocks on these mountains. They're totally covered by trees and bushes and grass. I bet there's some animals that live in here. Whoa, check out that waterfall. It is so tall. Wow, it looks like the water starts from the top and falls all the way down to the bottom. Wow, cool. This is so beautiful. It's like a bird just flying anywhere and everywhere I want to go. Well, <laughs> wherever, Doug, you want to take me. <laughs> Whoa, the sun is coming out. This is so beautiful. Wow, I bet we could get a suntan today. Hey, Doug. Thank you so much for flying so safe. <laughs> this is so much fun. Whoa, look at this. I can see beach, I can see farmland, I can see mountains. Wow, Oahu is such a special place and so beautiful. Whoa, do you see that? Yeah, it looks like something's in the water. Oh, I know what that is. That's coral. <laughs> yeah, they're actually living organisms and they look so cool from the air. Whoa, look at all these instruments gauges. They are very hard to read, but they tell the pilot very important information. Wow, look at Doug use that cyclic so then we can fly real safe. Whoa, what are these things? They're circles. But wait a second, what is this? Oh, I know what this is. This is a sandbar. Yeah, that's just sand underneath the water, but just, just a little bit underneath the water. <laughs> Whoa, check this out. This is the University of Hawaii's island. This is where they study a lot of cool things like marine life, creatures, and plants. It's really cool. Oh, there's the patch of ground that we took off from. Oh, I bet Doug is gonna land right here. Whoa, <laughs> this was so much fun. Wow, and now we're back safe on the ground. Wow, that was so much fun. Thanks for the ride, Doug. You're welcome, Blippi. All right, see you later. Bye-bye. <laughs> oh, let's get out of here. He has another tour to go on. Oh, <laughs> that was so much fun, wasn't it? I know. Wow, we got to see a lot of cool things. We got to see that waterfall. Whoa, that water looks so fresh. Oh, and all that coral. Yeah, at the beach. Wow, I sure do love Hawaii. Wow, what a beautiful place. See it spinning up? Wow! And weren't those mountains really tall? They're way taller when you're up in the high sky, huh? Whoa! They're spinning so fast! <laughs> I hope the next tour, they have a great time. Whoa! <laughs> Woo I sure do love Hawaii, and I love learning how helicopters work with you! Whoa! Well, if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Ready? B-L-I-P-P-I, -I. Flippy. Good job. All right, aloha. Hey, it's me, Flippy.
Rocky, and I was just dancing. <laughs> but it's really hot outside. I wish I could take a break. Well, no time for breaks when you're dancing. <gasps> Do you see that? Whoa, it's a popsicle cart, and I love popsicles. I think you and I should get a popsicle. Let's go. Hey. Hi, Blippi. How are you? What's your name? I'm Julia. Ooh. Would you like a handmade popsicle? Yeah, I love popsicles. What flavor do you have? This is cha-cha-cha. It's mango, pineapple, and chia seed. Ooh, that sounds so yummy. Mango, pineapple, and chia seeds. That is so yummy! <laughs> hey, glad you like it. Do you want to come see how they're made? Yeah! That would be so much fun. All let's right, go! Let's go! Welcome to my kitchen. Wow, look at this place. It's so cool! Thanks. Now, first thing, you need to gear up. <laughs> oh, check it out! This is an apron. Here we go. Wow. Okay, well, what do we have here? So these are all the ingredients we use to make our popsicles. Ooh, it looks like a bunch of fruit and vegetables. Yep, you got it. We actually use a lot of superfoods in our popsicles. So wow. you'll see kale and avocado and spinach and chia seeds. What's this? This is a coconut. Wow, that's cool. A coconut, cool. Well, what flavor are we making? I thought we could make Popeye. Popeye? Yeah! All right. Guess why I call it Popeye? Um, I don't know. Why? I use spinach. Okay. So here you go, hold the spinach. I was making a batch earlier, so I thought we could just add to it. Okay, so here's some spinach, and what do you have? Strawberries. Strawberries. And to sweeten it, we use dates. Ooh, dates. <laughs> All right. Come on back. Oh, okay. So here's the batch I was working on earlier. Oh, look at it. Right. Oh, that looks yummy. Go ahead and let's add it in. Okay. Bye bye, spinach. <laughs> and then here are some strawberries. Ooh. And dates. Yum. Now, what might be different about your kitchen is we have some big equipment we use here. Really? <laughs> I'm excited. Whoa, look at that. That thing is massive. What does that thing do? This is our immersion blender. Wow. So you put it in. Whoa. You hit the button. Whoa! So that just blends it up into yes. a liquid? It sure does. Wow, that looks so yummy. Well, now what do we do? Now we're gonna put it in our mold. Okay. And I'm gonna get my trusty pitcher. Ooh. All right. So it's basically three ingredients all blended up to make one. Yummy tasting liquid. So now what we're gonna do is we're gonna pour it in. Oh. And then you kinda just have to feed it through. Shake it around. Yeah. May I? Of course. Okay. Well, here's some more. Whoa! <laughs> we got some chunky ones in there. Yeah, that's okay. There's some more. Okay. And then next what we need to do is We'll just put in our sticks. Ooh. Yeah, like a popsicle stick. Have you ever eaten a popsicle and you hold on to the piece of wood? Yeah, that's what we just put in there. That's what makes them so handy. Okay. And now we put it into our extra special popsicle machine. Whoa, what does so, this thing do? It makes it super cold. It freezes a popsicle in 18 minutes. Wow, I'm so excited. I sure do love popsicles. Hey, check it out. It in. Whoa, so is that just really cold in there? Yes, it's actually made out of a special popsicle freezing liquid. Whoa, all I right. I can't tell you all my secrets. Huh. Well, maybe for later. Well, now what do we do? Well, usually when I wait for popsicles to freeze, 
like to dance. Okay, let's go! All right, let's see what we have to work with. All right, you know what kind of fruit this is, right? Yeah, this is an apple. Okay, looks like we have some grapes. Yum! Ooh, what are these? Check these out. Yeah, these are lemons. Lemons are the color yellow. Wow, and then we have some greens over here. Whoa, spinach. Wow! Whoa! Hello! <laughs> it's like hair! Whoa! Whoa! This is kale! And kale is really yummy! <laughs> and it doesn't like containers. <laughs> That's silly. Okay, let's put these back in here so then we can continue to see what type of fruits and vegetables we have. Like this! Whoa! This is so heavy! Whoa! Whoa! Ah! Yeah! This is a watermelon, and watermelons are so big and yummy. Do you know what color is on the inside of the watermelon? Yeah! Red! And the outside is green. Okay, just a couple more. Bananas and pineapple! Yum! Okay, so you can see we have this big bucket right here, and we need to put a lot of the ingredients right in here. Can't forget about the strawberries. We'll start with those. Here we go! Woohoo! <laughs> okay, that kale. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Let's put some in there. <laughs> we are doing so good. Oh, apples! Okay, we could put the whole apple in there, but I think we should probably slice it. Have you ever had a slice of an apple? They're so yummy. Okay, here is our red apple slicer. And then put it right in the center, just like that. And then you push down. Whoa, look at that. That is awesome. Slice the apples, so then you pull them out and then you can put them right in our big bucket. Wow. And you keep the core, whoop. <laughs> you keep the core, which is the center, out of it, because there's a lot of seeds in there. Oh, speaking of seeds, watermelons have seeds. <laughs> okay, let's cut open the watermelon. Whoa. I'm gonna be very careful because I'm a grown up with this knife. Ready? Okay, here we go. Chop it in half, just like that. Flip it around. Wow, look at that. That looks so yummy. Our popsicles are gonna be so yummy. 
Okay. Um, I have an idea. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> All right. We have some bananas. Open those up. Here we go. Bye-bye, banana. Woohoo! <laughs> and we'll do another banana. Yum! Here we go! <laughs> Yum! Look at it. Is that looking tasty or does that look tasty? <laughs> Whoa! And remember, we learned what fruit this is. Yeah, the coconut. All right, these are a little tricky to open, but it's worth the trouble. So let's take the coconut opener. Whoa, we did it! Look at that! Whoa! Whoa! Look at all that liquid! I just want to drink it all up. Oh, okay, we'll put that in the bucket for Popsicles! Whoa! Oh, yum! Okay, let's use this little coconut device and pull out some of the coconut meat. Yeah, right in there. Ooh, yummy! There we go. All right, perfect. Let's bring it right over here. Yum! All right. Oh, spinach right here. Woohoo! And then we have a bunch of grapes. We'll do one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven grapes. All right. And then remember these, we used these earlier. These are dates. Here we go! Whoa! Okay, can't forget about the lemons. We have so many types of fruits and vegetables in here. Here we go. Wow. Okay, let's take these and give a little squeeze. Woohoo! <laughs> have you ever tasted a lemon before? Okay, let's try some. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> That's sour. Okay, let's wash our hands. And then last but not least, we have a pineapple. We cut the pineapple just like that. And you see that yellow? That looks so yummy. So now we take this pineapple tool, put it right on top. And then, you give it a little twist. Wow. Look at that. And then, you pull it out. Whoa! Check that out! And then, take it off. Just like this. And that's gonna give it some nice, sweetness to these yummy popsicles. All right, I think that's plenty. Look at, whoa, that's so heavy. Come on back here. Remember that next step that we do? Yeah, she taught us that you put the bucket, whoa, right here and take the big blender. Whoa, whoa, and we blend it up. Here we go. Now it's all mixed up. Wait a second though. We need the magic tool. This is a giant whisk. Woohoo! Check this out. Alrighty, it's adding some color. <laughs> okay, let's put this right over here. And then we can bring this up and grab this pitcher. Remember from earlier, we need to scoop some out. 
Oh, I am so excited. Pour some in. Let's grab another scoop. Okay, here we go. Okay, whoa! All right, I think that's plenty. So let's give it a shake. Okay, yes, these are gonna be so yummy. And let's take these sticks. Wow, that's a lot of popsicle sticks. <laughs> Put them right in there. Oh, perfect. Okay, now we need to bring it to the cooling station. <laughs> Here we go. Set it down. <sighs> Woo, we did it. All right, now remember what we had to do earlier? It's gonna take a long time. So we get a dance while we wait. Be ready. Let's check them out. Woohoo! All right. Whoa, I am so excited. Okay, hey, we gotta yeah. drain them. I can't wait to see the ingredients you use. <laughs> Me too. <laughs> Whoa. Uh, nice and come. loose. <gasps> Whoa! Look at them! Whoa! My two favorite colors! Yeah! Check them out. Blue and orange. Shall we try them? Yeah. Mmm. Do you like them? These are delicious, Flippy. You know what? You need to take those outside and go sell some pops. Mm, awesome. All right. Let's go try some sell some popsicles. <laughs> popsicles, popsicles. Who wants a popsicle? <laughs> I love popsicles, and that was so much fun learning about how to make popsicles with you at Mom and Pop Shop in Costa Mesa, California. Well, this is the end of this video, but if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Ready? B L I P P I. Flippy! Good job! Well, see you later! Me, Flippy. Oh, whoa. And look at what it is. Whoa, it's an airplane. <laughs> Today, I'm at Air and Air at the Boeing Field in Seattle, Washington. <laughs> and you and I are going to learn about, yep, airplanes. Whoa. learn the exterior parts of the airplane. Do you see this? This is the nose of the airplane. Do you know why it's called the nose? <laughs> yeah, because it looks like a nose. <laughs> oh. Hey, come over here. Oh, up here, those are the windscreens. <laughs> They kind of look like windshields. Yeah, just like in cars. Whoa, so you don't get a bunch of bugs in your mouth. <laughs> Whoa, check out down here. Whoa, kind of looks like a wheel and a tire. Wait a second, that's because it is a wheel and a tire. This is the nose gear. This helps the airplane while it's on the ground. <laughs> Whoa. This is the cabin entry door. Check it out. Ooh, now we can go inside. Hello, hello. <laughs> okay. <laughs> whoa, whoa, look down here. It's another landing gear. 
This is the main landing gear. Yeah, it's another wheel and a tire. And there's another one on the other side. Oh, and the windows. Look, that's where the passengers look out from. Hello. Hey, let's count them. One, two, three, four, five. Whoa, good job. Whoa, what is this? It's a wing. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, it's so long. Wow. And it's so shiny. Look. Hello. <laughs> hey. <laughs> oh. Ooh, come back over here. Wow. That is the jet engine. Do you see it spin in a circle? Whoa. Around and around it goes. That's what provides the airplane with all of its power. Whoa! <laughs> Come on! Whoa! And the main body of the aircraft is called the fuselage! <laughs> Let's go to the back. Oh, wait! See that? That is the empennage! Yeah, the back of the aircraft. Oh, and in here, there's a cargo compartment. Open up, just like this. Hey, here we go. Whoa. Oh, you can store a lot of bags in there. <laughs> Whoa. Oh, and look up here. Wow. That is the horizontal stabilizer fin. That is the vertical stabilizer fin. It helps the aircraft be nice and stable in the air. Whoa! Ooh, another compartment. Wow. Let's open it up and see what's inside. Whoa! Check it out! A bunch of engine stuff. Interesting. Hey, I have another compartment to show you. Whoa! Whoa, look! Huh, what does this say? Fuel. 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 Oh, yeah! This is a fuel compartment. Whoop! <laughs> oh, check it out! Yeah, that's where the fuel goes. Fuel is kind of like food or water to you and I. <laughs> it's what powers and provides fuel to the jet engine. Whoa! Whee! is pretty awesome. There are so many types of planes out there, like this one. This plane is a business plane, and it's a passenger plane. And there's also leisure planes. <laughs> they look pretty similar. There are agriculture planes. Whoa! <laughs> there's also cargo planes. Whoa! They can hold a lot of cargo. Hey, yeah, seaplanes. Whoa. Seaplanes can land on land. Ooh, and military planes. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, there are so many types of planes out there. <laughs> I love planes.
Now let's take a flight inside the airplane. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> this is gonna be so much fun. Ooh, watch your step. Come on. Whoa, check it out over here. Wow, this is the cockpit and those are the pilots. Hello. Hi. <laughs> oh, let's take a seat. Oh, just like in a car, there's seat belts. Yep, first things first, safety first. You have to buckle up. Okay, this is gonna be so much fun. <laughs> Can you see? It's kind of like they're driving a car, but it's actually an airplane. <laughs> Look! travel, you might be able to fly in an airplane. And don't worry, it's not scary. It's actually really safe. <laughs> hey, I was just doing the airplane dance. <gasps> Will you do the airplane dance with me? gonna be so much fun. Here, I'll teach you. First, you put up your arms like you're an airplane. Whoa! Whoa! And you dance when you hear the music. But when the music stops, don't move a muscle. Ready? Flying in the air. 
Whoa, it's like I'm a bird. Wait, no, I'm an airplane. Hey, how about we sing the airplane song? editing on. <laughs> oh, enough of that. I need some water. You have to always remember to hydrate. <sighs> After a long day of playing, you need to drink a lot of water. Okay, let's put the desk back. Perfect. Ooh, check out back here. It's a sink. Whoa, you can wash your hands right there. <laughs> it's really important to keep your hands nice and clean. Ooh, and what's this? Huh, looks like a seat, but there's no seat belt. Huh. Whoa, <laughs> we know what that is. Yeah, that's if you need to use the restroom when you're in the air. Whoa. <laughs> wow, I have an idea. Let's go check out the cockpit. Oh, come on! Whoa! Whoa! This is a really tight squeeze. I don't think the Empire had Wookiees in mind when they designed this cockpit. <laughs> okay, anywho, first things first. Safety first! Let's buckle up! Okay, 
lap belt secured. And then we need our headset. <sighs> Hello? Can you hear me? Hey, yeah! Ooh. Tower, tower! This is Pilot Blippi! We're ready for takeoff! Okay, Pilot Blippi, you're good to go. <laughs> yeah! Good job! Okay, and you grab the yoke. Whoa! Look! Both yokes move at the same time! Whee! <laughs> yokes are kinda like steering wheels in a car. Whoa, and look at all of this! There's so many cool gadgets and avionics and buttons. I'm not gonna touch them for now. Ooh, in the throttle! Ooh. Push that forward, and then that's when you go really fast! Whoa! Ooh. And once you're in the air, this is the landing gear. Pull that up, and then the wheels and tires go inside the aircraft. Whoa! Airplanes are so cool! <laughs> Hello! Whoa! That was so much fun learning about airplanes with you! <sighs> well, I should probably get going now. <laughs> this is the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? B-L-I-P-P-I. -P -P -I. Flippy, good job. Thank you so much to Air and Air. Bye-bye. <laughs> Did you see that? Yeah, it's a remote control groomer toy. Huh? Oh, geez. I just wish this groomer toy was real. Whoa! Look at what it is. It's a real groomer. Today, you and I are gonna learn about groomers. Here we go. Now let's learn the exterior parts of the groomer. Come on. Whoa, look at this. This right here is the blade. Kind of like a bulldozer. It pushes anything and everything, the snow, out of its way. Huh? Watch it work. Watch. How the blade gets its power are the hydraulics. Check it out. Whoa, these are the hydraulics. There's hydraulic lines, the hydraulic cylinders. Whoa, so powerful. Ooh, and how you operate the hydraulics is from the cab. Whoa, it looks so cozy in there. Ooh, but first thing, when you're outside in the snow, it's snowing and you can't see. In order to see, you need windshield wipers. Whoa. See this? This is a massive windshield wiper. Whoa. Just like in a car. Watch them go. <laughs> okay, now you can see while operating. Ooh, and up there, those are the lights. Those also help you see. They go flash on, flash off. Whoa, they're so bright. Whoa, look at this down here. These, these are the tracks. Whoa, these go inside the snow and the ice and go so then you don't slip and slide. Ooh, and right here, 
This is the engine of the grater. Whoa. It produces so much power. And right here, this is where it gets its fuel. Yeah, diesel, not gas. Ooh, look at this. Whoa. This is the tiller back here. You see that? That's the barrel, and it has a lot of teeth on it. <laughs> it crushes and, and rips up the, the ice and the snow. So then from there, the flaps, see these? These are the flaps. And these little ripples, they create what's called corduroy. Whoa, it smooths out the snow. Okay, so now we're gonna back it up and from there, we'll smooth out the snow. Watch! Look at how smooth the snow is. Whoa, this is corduroy. Do you see these lines? Whoa, <laughs> it makes me wanna lay on it. <laughs> Whoa. Look at where we are. We're inside the groomer. Oh, let me shut the door. All right, first things first, safety first. Yep, just like in any vehicle, there's a seat belt. You gotta buckle up. All right, now that I'm all strapped in, let me show you some of the parts. Ooh, look at this. You see these two knobs? Yeah, these are the track sticks. Mm -hmm. They make you go forward, backward, and then you can turn left and right. Whoa! <laughs> Whoa, what is this? This is a joystick. This is what you use to control the blade and the tiller in the back. Wow, so many cool functions. Ooh, yes, look the key to the groom. <laughs> the key is a very important part. Once we have this, we can put it in and turn it on. Ready? Whoa, do you hear that? Yeah, the engine is purring. <laughs> Just like a kitty cat. Purr, purr, purr. <laughs> All right, are you ready? Here we go. Fun to drive. All right, now I'll go backwards. Get ready. Now I'm going to take the groomer forwards really quick. Now we're driving the groomer, or operating the groomer. <laughs> Ooh, do you hear the beep, beep, beep? That means we're backing up. Need to make sure you look back when you're backing up a vehicle. Whoa, 
<laughs> okay, forward we go. Whoa, you see these? This is how I'm driving, operating the groomer. These operate the tracks, so then you can go left and right. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> inside the mechanic shop of the groomer. This is where you fix the groomer at. Whoa, do you see the cab? Yeah, it's leaning forward. So then you can access the motor. I'll show you that later. But first, I wanna show you everything that's in here. Whoa, you can fix all the machines in here. Like this. Whoa, a really cool off-road machine. Check it out. Uh -oh. <laughs> All right, here I go. Oh, that was amazing. Whoa. <laughs> All right, what else do they have here? Oh, look at me. Yeah. This right here, ream, ream, ream. <laughs> this is a snow blower. Ooh, see these teeth? It turns in a circle, and then it forces the snow up here, then it goes <laughs> All right, let's put it back. Oh, all right. What else do they fix here? Let's see. Oh, cool, a three-wheeler. Whoa, <laughs> look at this. It has three wheels. One on the front, one on the back, another one on the back. Yeah, one, two, three wheels. Whoa. Oh, that was so much fun. Ooh, another machine. This machine is called a snowmobile. And it's the color blue. Huh, it looks like it's broken. See, the engine is all torn apart. Do you see that room back there? That's where they fix the snowmobiles at. Come on. Look at this room. Whoa. There's a chainsaw right here. <laughs> Ooh, even a leaf blower. Whoa. <laughs> Better put it on. <laughs> oh. Oh. Wow. oh, hey, like I said. This is where they fix the snowmobiles. This one's really old and it's probably broken, but hey, <laughs> they'll get to it later. Let's go over here. Ooh, another snowmobile. Ooh, this one's the color orange and yellow. <laughs> this is awesome. Whoa, the color red. Whoa, crazy bright red color with yellow. Wait a second. Flammable, keep fire away. Let's get out of here. Good thing we got out of there. Whoa, another machine. Whoa, this, yeah, this is a forklift. It uses the forks on the front right there to lift up. Giant pallets of stuff. Wow, what a cool machine. All right, okay, now let's show you the groomer and the engine of the groomer. Yeah, where it gets all of its power from. Come on. 
Remember me talking about the tracks? Mm -hmm. Yeah, they're really slippery. So what I'm gonna do is put some plywood on there so you and I can stand on it safely. pieces of plywood. Now you and I can stand on the tracks. Whoa! All right, we made it. Whoa, you see this? This is the engine of the groomer. Whoa, this is where all of its power gets produced from. Oh, and see this? This is the fuel tank. This is where all the diesel goes to fuel the engine. And let me show you the back. Whoa, you see the back? This is the hydraulic tanks. This is the hydraulic pumps. And all of these tubes are hydraulic tubes. Oh, look. Wow. We have some batteries, some oil filters, fuel filters, and you can't forget about, yeah, the exhaust! Woohoo! That was so much fun learning about groomers with you. Well, this is the end of this video, but if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Ready? B-L-I-P-P-I. -P -P -I. Blippi, good job. All right. Me, Flippy! And today I'm at the Skyline Marina in Anacortes, Washington. And marinas are where boats live. <laughs> and today, you and I are gonna learn about boats. <gasps> Look, there's one right here. <laughs> this is gonna be so much fun. I'm steering the boat. Whoa, this is so much fun. All right, I'm gonna pull back the throttle. This is the throttle. This is what you use to determine if you go forward or backward. And this is the steering wheel. You knew that. Whoa, whoa. What else is around here? Oh, hey, I wonder what this button does. Whoa, did you hear that? <laughs> That's the horn. Let's do it again. <laughs> That's so much fun. Ooh, and what's this? This is a radio. Hello, hello. Can you hear me? This is Blippi. <laughs> Radios are used to be able to talk to the people on the land and other boats. Ooh, and a navigation system? This is electronic, and this one is not. This is actually a compass. It tells you which direction you're heading. Wow, that's so useful. Ooh, and there's so many gauges and instruments. Hey, and a muffin. Let's try some. Hmm, hmm, <laughs> hmm. So tasty. All right, check this out. Here we go, let's go forward. Whoa, whoa, yeah! Check out the back, yeah, look.
boats are amazing pieces of machinery. <gasps> hey, when you're in a boat, and if you are 12 years or younger, then you need a life jacket. So, let's open up this compartment and take out a life jacket. And this life jacket is the color orange. Okay, let me put it on. Life jackets are really good to keep you safe. They keep you afloat if you go in the water. Let me turn this around, go to the back. Perfect, make it nice and snug. How do I look? <laughs> Whoa, yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Another piece of equipment that boats have on them is a life ring and that's used to throw it off so then the person that's in the water oh, can grab onto it and then you can pull them in. Here, I'll go get the life ring. Whoa, check it out. This is a life ring. Whoa, I wonder why they call it a life ring. Hey, I know, because it saves lives and it's the shape of a ring. Hey, so let me take it, get it situated, and I'm gonna act like there's someone out there that needs help. So I'm gonna take the end of it. Okay, I found it, and from there, I'm gonna chuck it out there really far. Three, two, one. Yeah! Did you see that? And then once they grab it, then you can reel them in like this. Okay, grab on tight. I'll pull you in. <laughs> Woohoo! like we saved someone. There we go, <laughs> good job. is a boat and it's out of the water. See, normally the water is up to here. <laughs> but it's out of the water. Hey, and check this out over here. Come here. Oh, and do you see down there? Those are the propellers. Wow, they spin around and push the water back to create thrust for the boat to go forward. Whoa! Hey, and look way up there. There's some buoys. Whoa. They're kind of like pillows and balloons, so then the boat doesn't hit the dock and get hurt. Wow, this power boat is really cool. Has big engines to provide a lot of power to the boat. Whoa, look at this boat. This boat is a catamaran. Check it out. Wow. Kind of looks hollow in the center. That's silly. And then kind of like a deck in the middle. Whoa. And how it gets power is from the wind. And then it blows on the sail and then it goes. Whoa. Hey, look. Here's another type of boat. And this boat, yeah, it's a power boat, but what it's used for is fishing. Wow, I see a lot of fishing pole holders up there. I bet they go fishing for salmon, tuna, crab, and all of those tasty food. Whoa, this boat is really big. Look how big it is. Whoa! 
looks so small hey. next to it. And this boat looks so big. Wow. Sailboats get all of their power from their sail. Whoa. Hey, and what are these down here? This is called a keel. It keeps the boat really stable in the water so then when the wind blows the sail, it doesn't fall over. Whoa! Sailboats and boats in general look like so much fun. is a kayak and kayaks are another type of boat interesting kayaks are powered by humans going like this with paddles and in here there's more kayaks come on whoa whoa look over here here they are wow this kayak is the color red Ooh, and back here, this kayak is the color yellow. Oh, oh, this one's hidden. But do you see this? This kayak is the color green. Kayaks are really fun because you sit in them with a life jacket on. Yeah, a life jacket. Whoa. Hey, let's try on a life jacket. Okay, take it off the hanger. Oh. <laughs> All right, so this is a life jacket. Whoa, Whoa. <laughs> and life jackets are really useful when you're near and on the water in boats because they keep you afloat if you're in the water. So then you don't have to go, oh. <laughs> and sometimes, if the water is really cold, you might wear a wetsuit. Oh, look at them back here. See, it's like their feet. And then the arms, and I think these are actually called dry suits because they actually keep you dry. So then the water doesn't touch you. Oh, let's see what else is around here. Oh. Yeah, the paddles or the kayak. Whoa, Whee! <laughs> this is so much fun. Okay, I'll go back this way. Whoa, <laughs> Whee! <laughs> oh, ah. This building is so big. Have you ever wondered where boats get stored so then they can go inside away from the weather, like the rain, the wind, and the ice? Whoa! Yeah, a building like this stores many, many boats. Hey, check it out. Doggy, <laughs> look, this dog is being nice and safe with this life jacket on. Hello, <laughs> oh, so soft, so cute, and so safe. <laughs> Whoa, what a beautiful day it's been. Oh, look, do you see what I see? Wow, yeah, sea life. Whoa, let's get a little closer and say hello. Hey. Hey, how are you? Wow, that's a seal. It's just laying out in the sun, 
feels so good. <laughs> I'm going to go a little bit closer. Hey, how are you? Wow. It's so cute. Look at its big black eyes. Hey. <laughs> Hello. I wonder what its name is. We should name it. I have an idea. Let's name it Seely. <laughs> hey, Seely. <laughs> All right, Seely. Have a good day. Bye bye. <laughs> oh, I love the marina. How big this boat is. Wow. Jeez, it's so long. Oh, hey, it's so big it even has windows inside. Hello. <laughs> That's silly. Whoa, and look how tall it is. Hey, I have an idea. Why don't I start at the back of the boat and then I'll step it out and count the steps to see how long it is. Ready? One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. This boat is sixteen steps in length. Good job! Whoa! it is to have this muffin on this boat. <laughs> Let me show you around this boat. Whoa! As you saw, that was the table. Ooh, in this area is a great place to prepare some food. Check it out! A fridge! Hello, fridge! <laughs> you can keep all your food nice and cold. Ooh, in a sink? What's that doing in there? <laughs> so silly. <laughs> okay, what else is around here? Whoa, this boat is awesome. Check it out. Ooh. That's the captain. Hello. <laughs> He's steering the boat. And down here is the inside of the boat. Come on. Wow, this is amazing. Whoa, it looks like a stove top right here where you can cook some food. Ooh, a sink. Whoa, that's a big sink. Some paper towels. Can't forget those. Ooh, a microwave. <laughs> oh, that's convenient. There's even a TV right here. Hey, that's me. <laughs> oh, in a bed. Oh. No time for sleeping. <laughs> Ooh, another table. I could eat tons of snacks right here. Nom 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 nom. Nom 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 nom. Woo! A fuel pump? <laughs> That's gas. And this is diesel. Hmm, interesting. Hey, I have something to show you. Come here. <laughs> Just like how cars need gas and diesel to run on the land, boats also need gas or diesel. And this boat right here needs gas. So, let's take this pump right over here and let's go fill it up. Whoa! What a long hose! Hey, 
Check it out! This is the gas cap of the boat. So let's unscrew it. Okay, be very careful. And then put it right in there and pull the trigger. Did you hear that? It's nice and full. All right, let's put the cap back on. And now it's full to the top so we can have some fun in the sun. <laughs> hanging out in the water on this boat. I sure do love boats, and it was so beautiful out there. Hey, I have an idea. Why don't we sing the Blippi Boat Song? Whoa, look at what it is. This is a tank, and I have an idea. Today, let's learn about Buoyancy and density. <laughs> Buoyancy and density. Okay, first, what we're gonna do whoa, is fill up this tank full of water. And then, once this tank is full of water, then you and I are gonna go outside and find some objects and we're gonna put it in the water and play a game. And that game is gonna be called Sink or Float. <laughs> so we're gonna guess which items are gonna either sink or float. Wow, this is gonna be so much fun. Okay. <sighs> Just a little bit more water. Whoa. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, that right there is a perfect amount of water. Now let's go get some objects so then we can guess if they're either gonna sink or float. <laughs> whoa, whoa, <laughs> whoa. <laughs> Here we go. Okay, now that we're outside, let's go find some things to see if they either sink or float. <laughs> oh, look, this day is going so perfect so far. It's a tote, so we can put stuff in it, of course. Oh, look, our first object, a flower. These are dandelions, and they're bright yellow. I used to collect dandelions and give them to my mother and say, here you go, mom, I love you. <laughs> hey, mom, I love you. <laughs> Wow, some colorful balls. This one is the color red. This one is the color purple. This one is the color green. This one is the color yellow. This one is the color blue. And this one is the color orange. <laughs> okay, wow, look at all the things in here. I wonder if they'll sink or float. Ooh, a balance beam. <laughs> Whoa. Wait a second. Are you seeing what I'm seeing? Come here, look. This is a CD, a compact disc, and it says Blippi on top. I wonder if it sinks or floats. <laughs> Whoa. 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 Wow, look, two. Pine cones. Pine cones come off of trees and they land on the ground. But this time, they were right here. Perfect for us to see if they sink or float. Put them in the tote. <laughs> I dropped a pine cone and a dandelion. <laughs> come on. Whoa. Whoa, I'm so dizzy. Whoa, Whoa. look. Wow, a paintbrush. Yeah, a paintbrush and some glue. I wonder if these sink or float. <laughs> I guess we gotta wait and see. Put them in there. And here we 
Let's go. Oh, cool. Monkey bars. I love monkey bars. Whoa. Whoa. Okay. Wait a second. Look. Some orange blippy glasses. Hello. <laughs> Hello. Okay. Oh. And I bet you know what these are. Yeah. These are rocks. Yeah. And I bet you could guess pretty easy if they're going to sink or float. But let's go see. gathering all these items with you. Okay, now we get to put the items inside the water and we're gonna see if they're gonna sink or float. <laughs> okay, here we go. Let's start off with an easy one. Ooh, wow, look at these. Do you see them? Yeah, these are rocks. Well, they're really heavy. Whoa. So if these rocks are heavier than the water for the same amount of space, then they're gonna sink. So do you think it'll either sink or float? Yeah! Let's put them in. And look, they sink. Good job. Whoa. Okay, all those rocks went all the way down to the bottom. Okay, let's try a little bit harder one. Okay, ooh, look, colorful balls. They don't sound very heavy and they're really light, and they're actually filled with air. See? <laughs> okay, let's see here. Oh, let's do the blue one. Ready? Do you think it will either sink or float? Okay, let's see. Yeah, it floats. All these balls that are sealed and filled with water float on top of the water. Okay, let's try another thing. Oh, oh we forgot the red one. That one floats too. Ooh, okay. Some glue. Whoa, so slippery. Some glue. Okay, do you think it'll either sink or float? It's kind of heavy. It's plastic. Okay, <laughs> I think I know. Do you think it'll sink or float? Okay, here we go. Whoa, it floated to the top. Wow, <laughs> that is so cool. Okay, here we go. Oh, look, we have some dandelions. Whoa, look at them. They're so pretty. Mm, and they smell so good. <laughs> okay, do you think these will either sink or float? Guess one way to find out is to put it in the water. Ready? Three, two, one. <laughs> it's floating. Good job. Okay. Oh, look, we have a blippy CD, compact disc. Ready? Do you think it'll sink or float? Okay. <gasps> Whoa! Whoa! It barely sinks to the bottom. Okay, I guess it sinks. Oh, and a couple more things. Pine cones. Whoa, so prickly. Oh, oh. <laughs> okay, here we go. Woohoo! They float to the top. Okay, ooh, another pair of blippy glasses. Hello, hello, I can't see. Ah, oh, there I go. <laughs> okay, here we go. Ready? Whoa, those sink. They must be really dense. Okay, and last item. Ooh, a paintbrush. Okay, do you think this paintbrush will sink or float? I'm so excited. Okay, ready? One, two, three. It floats! Wow! Oh! One last thing. Beep, 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 beep. Yeah! Look! It's a dump truck. Whoa! And it has something in the back. Whoa, look at it. Let's pour this in the back. 
just made the water turn green! Woohoo! Cowabunga! It's turning it into green ooze. Whoa, this is gonna be cool. Okay, let's let it sit here for a little bit. Wow. Whoa, it's getting really slimy already. <laughs> Whoa. Well, that was so much fun seeing these items either sink or float. Good job. Maybe we should do this again. If you want to watch this video again with these same items, just search Blippi, Sink, or Float. <laughs> yeah, because that's the fun game we just played. Whoa, whoa, look at this in here. Whoa, so cool. Whoa, it's turning into slime. Hey, it's me, Blippi, and today, I'm at the Phoenix Zoo in Phoenix, Arizona. Hey, I think you and I should learn about some animals today. Let's go. Whoa, do you see that? That is a howler monkey. Yeah, do you see it? Yeah, right there. That is Bilbo, named after Bilbo Baggins. <laughs> That's funny. Let's act like monkeys together. That's Lulu the rhinoceros. And Lulu is 21 years old. <laughs> yeah, Lulu, party! Yeah! That's a toucan. Did you see its big beak? Kind of looks like a banana. Let's check out another animal. Oh, whoa, look at this. Do you know what animal this is? Yeah, this is a tiger. Whoa, hello kitty. <laughs> whoa, come over here, turn around. Whoa, this is where the tigers live. Hey, and look at who it is over here. Looks like we're getting ready to do some training. See that? The tiger is doing exactly what he's saying. It looks like they're having so much fun. Target. Good. Target. Ooh, that was really cool. Did you see that? Hey, will you tell us why we just did that? Yeah, so uh, we train our animals so that um, they have the opportunity to make things easier for them and the staff. Mm -hmm. So we don't train our animals to do tricks, um, we do what are called behaviors. So for example, when I was having Jay target his nose to the end of this pole, um, it allowed me to move him to different positions so I could see different parts of his body. Um, having him stand up is not only impressive to see how big a tiger is, um, but it gives me the chance to see his underside. Because just like us, they can get injuries like cuts and bruises. So it lets me check up on his body to make sure he's still feeling good. Ooh, well thank you so much for showing me what you just showed me. You're very welcome. All right, see you later. Thanks. <laughs> let's go see some more stuff. Whoa, 
Do you see that animal? It's another cat. This is a jaguar. Whoa. I have a pail of carrots and some tongs. And we just got told we need to feed the next animal. Come on. Ooh. Hey, check it out. These are cables that you have to be on this side of them. But we just got permission to head inside so we can feed the animals. Let's go. Okay, this is a short barrier. Interesting. That wasn't too hard to get in. Oh, I see the animal, look. Let's go through the trees. Whoa, hey look, look at the animal. We get a feed, check it out. Whoa, do you know what kind of animal this is? This is a tortoise. Let's feed the tortoises, yeah. Check this out, this is a carrot and I'm using tongs because tortoises have really strong jaws. It might bite my finger off. Here you go. Whoa, oh, whoops, it slipped. <laughs> Here you go. Whoa, okay, would you like a little bit more? Yeah, okay, here you go. Oh, there you go. Whoa. This tortoise is about 550 pounds. Whoa, that is really heavy. Hey, and guess how old he is? Oh, he's 66 years old. Oh, that's really old. Oh, hello. Hey, check this out. I'll pet this tortoise's head. Hello, how are you? Whoa, whoa, look, the tortoise is off the ground. Do you see that? Because that allows for all the bugs and everything to get away from its underneath area. Whoa, okay, let's go get some more carrots. Whoa, hello, how are you doing? Are you having a good day? Ooh, check it out. See this tortoise? This tortoise is a Galapagos tortoise, and it's a female. Oh, oh, there you go. Oh, and here comes the male. Whoa, do you see how big he is? Oh, I'm getting trapped. Okay, I'm gonna loop right around here. See how this one's a little smaller? And this one is bigger? Whoa! This is a female, and this is a male. Whoa! Hey, do you two like each other? Yeah, you two look like your friends. <laughs> oh, would you like some more? Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> Good job. Oh, you dropped it. <laughs> hey, come a little closer. Okay, here you go. All right. Open wide, here comes the carrot. Whoa! There you go. Is that yummy? Hey, tortoises like carrots, just like how I do. And carrots are nice and healthy. There you go. Whoa! You have a big mouth. Whoa! Look! I'm giving this tortoise a scratch, see? How does that feel? Does that feel good? Yeah! Do you see how the tortoise is standing on its legs really high in the air? In the wild they do this because a lot of times they have bugs underneath them and this allows for the finches, which are birds, go, go, to fly underneath there and then eat all of the bugs underneath this tortoise. Yeah, but for now, he's standing on his legs because this feels really good. 
It's kind of like when a grown-up gives you a back scratch. Yeah, I like when my mom gives me a back scratch. Yeah, how does this feel? You like that? Yeah. <laughs> okay, my turn. Okay, my turn. I'm ready. I'm ready. Oh no. Ooh, check this out. This is an armadillo. Okay, here you go. Run free. Whoa, look. An armadillo is one of the ambassador animals at the zoo. That means it's an animal that you can meet face to face. Whoa, hey. What are you doing? You want a treat? Armadillos love mealworms. Here you go. Uh-oh. Hey, come right over here. Here you go. Look, doesn't this armadillo look hard? Yeah, it is kind of hard. And it's not a shell. It's bone inside the armadillo's skin. Whoa. <laughs> okay. Ooh, this is Princess Buttercup. Ooh, all right, here you go. Here you go, Princess Buttercup. Ooh, look at Princess Buttercup's pretty little nails. Whoa. Okay, run free. Whoa, look at this animal. What kind of animal is this? This is an Indian crested porcupine. Whoa, look at all of its spines. Are those spines? The big ones are just to make her look scary, but the dangerous ones are down by her tail. Oh, okay, down there, whoa. And what is she doing right now? We're just enjoying some snacks. Ooh. She likes a lot of plants, so we've got her some biscuits, some yam, and some apple today. Ooh, that sounds pretty tasty, actually. Ooh. Let's take a closer look at the porcupine. Wow, you don't want to touch this animal on its tail. <laughs> This next area is really cool. Whoa, do you hear that? All these things are working really hard to keep this next area exactly like how the ocean is. Come here. Whoa, look at it. Whoa, there's so many filters and, and other things. It's so cool. Okay, come over here. Let me show you what it's doing. Yeah, this is Stingray Bay. And they're training the stingrays to do some pretty cool tricks. If you come to this zoo, you can use a flat, gentle hand and touch the stingrays on their back. But they're letting me go inside. <laughs> I'm so excited. Okay, first, I need to take off my shoes. One shoe. Whoa, two shoes. Okay, let's put those there. Can't forget about the socks because I'm gonna put these on. Whoa, they're like water socks or water shoes. Okay, let's put them on. All right, okay, okay, <laughs> I'm ready, here we go. You have to be nice and smooth and slow so you don't scare them. Oh, oh the water's nice and cold. Okay. Whoa. <laughs> oh, hey. Hi. How are you? Good. How are you? Good. What's your name? My name is Mary and this is Kelsey. We work here at the Phoenix Zoo. Ooh. So what are you doing right now? So right now we're giving breakfast to our stingrays and we're checking them to make sure everybody's healthy and happy this morning. Ooh. That sounds like fun. Can I help? 
Sure, would you like to feed some? Ooh, yeah! Let's feed the stingrays. Okay. So Look at them. They <laughs> have shrimp and smelt. So you can take a Ooh. couple and you can put it in your hand. Okay. Check out the food. Whoa! Looks so tasty. Okay, I put it in my hand. You're gonna hold it like an ice cream cone. Okay. Ooh, I like ice cream. <laughs> okay, just like that. Put it nice and deep into the water. They're gonna swim over your hand and they're gonna suck it out of your hand like a vacuum. Okay. Okay, here you go. Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! Whoa, look at that one. So you've got a uh, blue spotted ribbon tail sitting on your feet. <laughs> okay, do I go deeper in the water? Let's see what we can do. Oh, there Come you on, go. guys. Oh, I did it, look, it's gone. <laughs> it sucked it right out of my hand. Can I do it again? You can, can oh. oh, thank you. <laughs> they sucked the food right out of my hand. It's kind of like, have you ever put a vacuum on your hand and then the vacuum sucks on your hand? That's kind of how it feels like when it's sucking the food out of your hand. Whoa, <laughs> that one just swam through my legs. <laughs> Whoa, look at them. So they're getting used to you now. So they can yeah. feel who you are by your heartbeat. Okay. They're understanding that you're not gonna hurt them and so they're coming closer and closer Whoa. as they're getting more and more comfortable with you. Yeah, look at them. Hello. Whoa! <laughs> that scared me! What happened there? They just got a little bit excited. Okay. Excited, not scared? Yeah. Okay. Because I kind of got scared. <laughs> but that's okay. They kind of seem really gentle. Oh! Whoa! Whoa! There they go again! <laughs> Look at how wet I'm getting! <laughs> Alright. Let's feed some more. Take a camel ride. <laughs> Have fun, Flippy. Thank you. Come on. Look, this is the top of the camel. See the hump? I'm gonna sit on top of it. Whoa! Now I'm on top of a camel. Okay, here we go. Right, Check it out. Whee! I'm on the hump of the camel. Whoa, this is a nice camel. This is a dromedary camel. It's really high up here. Whoa, <laughs> I'm having so much fun. <laughs> Wee, hello. the hump of the camel, they store fat in here. And they can actually go about seven months without eating food. Or three to four weeks without drinking any water. That's pretty impressive, huh? Whoa! Whee! <laughs> Whoa! some pretty long legs, huh? And it has four legs. And you and I have two. Whoa. All right, this is pretty fun. Whoa, <laughs> that was awesome. Thank you very much. Yeah, you're welcome. All right, okay, let's go see some more animals. Ooh, now we're behind the scenes of the native Arizona exhibit. Ooh, check it out. Look, 
some tools. Hey, what does this look like? Kind of looks like a golf club. <laughs> but actually, see how it has a hook? It's used to handle certain types of reptiles, like a snake. Okay, but I'm not gonna use that because I'm not a trained professional. Ooh, check it out. Wow, some aquariums. <laughs> the fish are on the other side. We're behind the scenes. Whoa, look at this room. Whoa, this is a box. And this is where a snake lives. Let's read what kind it is. Rattlesnake. Venomous? <gasps> okay, I don't think I should handle that one. Cause like I said, I'm not a trained professional. <laughs> Let's find a snake that I can handle. Whoa, this room's pretty cool. Whoa, there's so many cages right here. Whoa, what are these? These are snake sheds. Wow, every snake sheds its skin every couple months. Look at that, and they're all in one piece. Look, doesn't that look like a snake? Yeah, that's pretty cool, huh? Okay, okay, I'll keep these right here. Okay. Yeah, this one looks like a good snake to handle. I'm handling a snake. Whoa, and look at the color of this snake. It's orange and white and black. Whoa. I used to be afraid of snakes when I was a child, but now I'm not. But some snakes you definitely don't want to hold. So if you ever see a snake in the wild, just to be safe, you probably shouldn't try and hold it like this. Okay, whoa! Look, are you having fun, Snake? Whee! Hello! Hey! Whoa, look at it! Whoa! It's so intrigued with the camera! Whoa! This is awesome. We're behind the scenes of another reptile area. Whoa, there's so many cool tanks in here with so many unique creatures. Whoa, <laughs> hey, whoa, look right here. Oh, hey, there's someone over here, come here. Whoa, hey, what are you doing? Just getting ready to check out one of our horned lizards. Did you want to hold him? Yeah, a horned lizard, that's cool. Okay. Okay, thank you. Whoa, look! This is a horned lizard. Check out its horns. Wow. <laughs> he's so cute. Oh, and he's just hanging out. <laughs> okay, well, thank you very much. You're welcome. Okay, there you go. That was awesome. Good job. Let's go. Hello, hello. <laughs> wow. Oh. A lion? Ooh, an elephant. <laughs> Whoa, look! <laughs> this is a gorilla. <laughs> and some snakes? Yeah, I gotta hold a snake. Whoa. Isn't that cool? Whoa. <laughs> Whoa, there's so many cool things in here. Okay, follow me. Ooh, there's even a dinosaur. A Tyrannosaurus Rex. Interesting. Well, hey, that was so much fun learning about animals with you at the zoo. 
this is the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? <laughs> Ready? B L I P P I. Flippy. Good job. All right. See you later. <laughs> I was just acting like a horse because in this video, it's all about horses. We're going to have so much fun. First, let's listen to a little bit of the horse song, but then Georgia and Taylor, two little girls that ride ponies, they're going to teach you about horses and ponies. Let's go. Flippy! Horses like to eat lots of hay and grass. It makes them big and strong. They have beautiful manes and poofy tails with hair so nice and long. Horses can run faster than you or me. They're like a speeding train. But oh, they can pack a powerful kick just with their hind legs so be sure not to stand behind them if you get the chance to be near one maybe just bring an apple that's their favorite snack <laughs> horses galloping through the countryside i wish that i had one to ride horses This is my pony, his name is Flash. My pony's name is Dot. Before you put on the saddle, you have to burst the pony. This is a pony's horseshoe, and this is a horse's horse's shoe. The saddle pad protects the pony from the saddle. This is a horse pick and it picks horses' hose.
much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout. Did you love learning about horses and ponies with Taylor and Georgia? Yeah, I did too. And they really know how to ride those ponies really good and maintain good safety. That's so important. They're so cool. Well, let's not stop here. Let's continue to learn about horses and have fun. This is a horse. <laughs> Did you know horses can sleep standing up and laying down? Go. Whoa, whoa! Estimates suggest that there are about 60 million horses on this planet. <laughs> That's a lot of horses! Horses are herbivores. That means they eat plants. Um, 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 yummy. Let's draw a horse. First, let's draw the body, and the back leg, and the front leg. And there's the head. Hmm, the little ear. Two ears. And the eyeball, the nose, and the mane. The horse's mane. You can't forget about that back tail, and the other back leg other front leg. Now it's really looking like a horse. Now let's give it some detail. Like the hooves. <laughs> 